Taking a look at our weather now, warm, hot, and hazy. Three words I'm not crazy about, Brandon, to start off this Monday, as we're seeing now a, a warm up from the weekend, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah, unfortunate because we're going to be saying those words a lot over the next couple of days. We're actually heading into some hotter weather than we're uh, starting at right now. 85 right now. It's definitely warm for this time of year. It's a little bit warmer than average, but it's not too hot. Of course, we had those mid 90s last week, and those are going to be coming back as well. Four degrees warmer than this time yesterday, and a little bit of a northwest wind at nine miles per hour. Taking a look at our overall weather pattern. Here's what's built in for tomorrow. You see this big bump in those lines. That's a big upper level ridge. It's not quite as pronounced as the one last week, but it's firmly in control of our weather. So we're going to be very stable, very calm, and our temperatures are going to be on the rise here as we head through the forecast. So let's take a look at what we can expect through the day tomorrow. Temperatures are climbing all the way up into the mid 80s by the time we get to 1 p.m. So early afternoon tomorrow, we're already as warm as we were today, and we continue to climb from there temperatures getting well into the 90s by the time we get to the afternoon. So it is going to be a pretty hot day once again tomorrow and we continue to see those temperatures climb later in the forecast. 90s over in the desert, 90s for us here in the valley, even some places in the mountains as warm as the upper 80s. So definitely a warmer day for us. Not all that much wind, especially here in the valley. The winds really not going to be too much of a factor. A little bit of a breeze as is typical through the mountains and the desert, but nothing all that significant. And with the air not moving around that much, as you'd expect, our air quality is going to get a little bit worse. So it was in the good range today. Day. Didn't have a ton of haze out there. We'll have a little bit more tomorrow. We're in the moderate range with an AQI of 58. Let's take a look at that extended forecast because I said temperatures continue to climb and they certainly do. 97 for us on Wednesday for Cinco de Mayo. That would be the hottest day of the year so far. Still at least staying under 100 in the valley. That is a small victory. Down to about 90 with some breezier conditions for us on Thursday. Starting to get some more of that cooler ocean air blowing in towards the end of the week. And as we head into the weekend, things do look a little bit better. Not cool by any means, but more comfortable. Comfortable. Lower 80s to mid 80s by the time we get toward Mother's Day. And as we head into next week, it looks like we will see those temperatures bumping up a little bit once again. So kind of ups and downs, pretty typical for this time of year. Seven day forecast for our mountain communities. Warm tomorrow, warmer again on Wednesday. Up into the 90s for Lake Isabella. Low to mid 80s for Fraser Park into Hatchapee. Cooling down as that ocean air starts to flow in on Thursday. Really see the influence of that though. Friday, Saturday into Sunday. Temperatures dropping all the way down into the 60s for the South Mountains. 70s for Lake Isabella. And then again, we start to see that slow warm up once again as we head into next week. But certainly some more warm weather in the forecast here.